Guys, no pictures, please. No pictures. You're looking at the Masters Champion, baby. The Masters Champion's here, and we're back for another final round at Augusta. We've won the Masters last year after coming up heartbreakingly short four times in a row with second place finishes. But here today, I am coming for the second victory in a row. I paused after coming. It made it weird, but we're okay. I'm ready. Let's do this thing, Sunshine. Uh, we're ready to play the Masters Tournament once again, and potentially for the very last time as this player. We'll see what happens. I'm thinking of starting a new career after this. Um, retire at the top of my game. We'll see what happens, but uh, yeah, let's do this thing, my friends. Let's do this thing. Patrick Cantley is two shots clear of us and one shot clear of Aaron Badley, and we are looking to hunt him down, but if he's anything like he was in round three, we're gonna be in big, big trouble because he wasn't missing putts at all. So we're gonna ho hope for a worse day from Patrick Cantley. I'm wearing my green as well for the Masters. Let's watch the promo and let's get into this thing. Sunday at Augusta. Three simple words that bring to mind those timeless images of yesteryear. And what lies in store today? What decisions to be made? What putts to agonize over? What roars will echo and reverberate to the second nine? And who will be left standing in the twilight, trophy aloft, sporting a new green jacket? This is the final round of the Masters. The final round at the Masters, my friends. The crowd are out, and we are ready to go. We're ready to defend our title. Patrick Cantley has taken a Masters title from me before, but never again. Not this time. He beat me by one on the final hole a few years ago, and I've not forgiven him for it. So today, we are here for vengeance. Look at the current leaderboard on this Sunday afternoon. Patrick Cantley is going to drown in a puddle of his own blood today. And it's not going to be of his own making. It's going to be from me. Guys, please do check out my other channel, The Hound, if you're interested in watching me play through story games. I'm currently playing through Dragon's Dogma 2, the original Tomb Raider games, the newer Tomb Raider games as well. Um, I'm trying to think of what else I'm playing right now. I'm playing just a bunch of stuff. Just finished GTA 4. Um, and, and just overall having a blast with that channel, uploading daily pretty much. And yeah, give it a chance, see what you think. We're over 12,000 strong on that channel now. And we're over 186,000 uh, 186, strong here on the Apex Sound channel. Thank you for that. We just hit 186,000 subscribers. The channel is doing really well at the moment. The Masters videos are doing really well. And Patrick Cantley came to play. That is a banging golf shot. He's going to make that. There's no doubt in my mind. Any putt within 20 foot, I think Cantley's going to make. All right, it is up above, but the wind is helping. And it's off the right. So I'm just going to play a little banger here. By the way, the beard is gone. Just in case you didn't notice, the beard is gone. I didn't do the best job, but it's gone. Ew. Might get away with it, maybe? No. I mean, yeah, it's not terrible. It's closer than Patrick, maybe. Yeah, it is. We did get away with it, because it wasn't a great swing. It was under swingy, and it was fast. Let's see if Cantley makes it first. I'm going to look at the camera, and I'm just going to look at it until it drops. Perfect there, down the slope. It's in for there you go. I can do that on pretty much any putt today, and that's how it's going to go. All right? It's just the way the cookie's going to crumble today. We are going to need to be on the very top of our game. And that's not a good start. It's not a good start at all. It's an under-red putt on the first, and Patrick Cantley is three shots clear of us now, and that's going to be a major, major problem. Where we're really going to have to gain ground is the par fives. Because they the AI never eagles par fives. They might birdie them sometimes, but they never eagle them. So we're going to need eagles to gain on the AI today. I think that's the only way we do it. There is four gettable par fours at Augusta. There's four gettable par fours here at Augusta. And we are going to need to get at them. Especially this one. I feel like this is the most scorable one. The green is difficult, but the tee shot, if you can get away, you're basically having a short iron in. So I think this and the 13th are the are the two more scorable par fives.
All right, Cantley's right into the bunker. That's good for us. Oh, and that couldn't quite. It's going to be a layup for Cantley, and it's not going to be a layup for for us. I can tell you that much right now. I'm playing a high draw here, and we're going after it. It's a banger. That's as good as it gets right there. As good as it gets. Watch this bounce along down now as well. Didn't actually get the bounce I thought it would. I thought it was going to bounce down towards the green. But it kind of just bounced straight. 206 yards in. Mid-iron for me. And we're looking good. I had a golf lesson in real life yesterday, guys. It went pretty well. Um, I was up at the golf club. Um, I was on the chipping green just practicing a little bit of chipping. And it was sunny. And it was like this weather here that you're seeing in the game. And not maybe... Okay, this is I'd say play. five minutes into be, be, being on the putting green, the sun goes down, it gets really windy. I'm like, Jesus, it's actually quite cold. And I'm, but I'm still chipping away. I'm like, I need to grind out here. And it starts just absolutely viciously raining. And I mean, it was pissing down. And I, I couldn't believe it. Out of nowhere, like. Um, and eventually, I think I'm actually going to go with a seven iron finesse. Is that crazy? I don't think it is. Play a little seven iron finesse. Watch this work. And yeah, I had to run inside, um, and then eventually got a. It, it just came back to, to sunny again, and I went out and did some putting, and then got my lesson. I got my lesson inside the simulator, which was nice to see. Working on increasing my swing speed, getting it back to um, what it was before my injury, and I think so far it it go, 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 get down the hill. Oh, it, it wasn't quite enough, but it's a decent decent shot. 33 foot left for an eagle but yeah i, I think we were we were trying the seven iron right and ooh. like i had got a, a lesson beforehand like a few months back maybe even earlier this year i would say start of the year i'd got a lesson and my swing speed with the seven iron was 75 miles an hour um which is i should be a lot higher than that all right i should be a lot higher than that there's some fundamentals in the swing that you can change to make it better. But I was getting between 82 to 85 miles an hour yesterday. Which is such a huge increase. Um, nearly 10 miles an hour since since the start of the year. Or end of last year. Something like that. I can't remember exactly. But yeah, it was great to see. Um, and hopefully that will continue to improve and improve and improve. As I get more confident um, swinging the club. And yeah, I was hitting my 7 iron. It wasn't amazing or anything. But we're getting there. Definitely a lot left in the tank, which is good. You know, we can kind of still improve and improve and improve. And that's the plan. We just need to keep it in the gym. That's a good looking putt. Is it ever? Just a little too much, though. All right, Cantley's just off the green. I'm hoping he chips it because they never chip in. If he chips it, he's going to get a par. If he puts it, he's going to make it. <laughs> I have a feel. Yeah, oh, God, he's going to make it. He's going to make it, dude. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. All right. Give a chance to get back within two. But the thing is, we need to take these opportunities. We cannot afford to miss opportunities like this. Plain and simple, really, to be honest. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Gave it a little extra, and I'm glad I did. Gave it a little extra, and I'm glad I did. One under two for the both of us. One under two, two for the both of us. Okay. We'll take that. I said it's going to be the par fives. We're going to need to gain on them. And I was staying with the Eagles, but we gained that in with a birdie, which was kind of surprising, honestly, but I'll take it all day long. It's a birdie par start for Kentley. It's a par birdie start for myself. Badley gets to 20 under as well, so he's birdied the first hole. Also, great to see. Not really. John Hur's in the mix as well. He was 18 under starting. So, ooh, is this reachable with that wind? I just gotta. I gotta try. Middle of the green. I gotta try. No! You need to fade it, man! Just didn't fade. Oh, I think that would be really good, actually. In that bunker. It's not going to be pretty now, though. All right, it might not be the worst. Maybe a blast shot. Oh, man, I really would love to see what would happen if that faded back a little bit, though. I'd love to just see if that would have held the green. I think it would have struggled to hold the green, but at the same time, it would have had a chance. Ain't a problem, baby. Ain't a problem with me. This maybe a touch right. Okay, that's gonna be safely. All right, a little layoff for Cantley. You need to play from if you're Good shot. Leaves himself 67 yards, maybe. 
Let's see it, Patty Ice. Patty Ice. That's short, though, is it? Ooh. He's lucky. And that's a makeable putt up the hill for sure for Kentley. I think I'm playing the pick here. Playing the pick with a little bit of height and try and get it to stop somewhere close to that green. To that pin, rather. I hope it's close to the green. <laughs> okay, let's go. Yeah, it's good. It's good, not great. Okay. It's good, not great. Can't late from 18 foot to really pile the pressure on me. Early doors. It's missed. Yes. Okay, that's huge. If we could get get within one here early. Sets the tone of the round. Everything's looking good. Come on. It's definitely turning right to left. And it's like, it's not a lot though. I will say that. It's not a lot. And it's up the hill quite a bit. So, let's just play right edge. You've got to be shitting my dick! I even brought it in a little bit because I was like, yeah, I'm giving it too much. And it still was too much? Oh. Lip out Larry strikes me in my heart early doors and that's tough to take. Alright. Screw you, Kentley. You know? Screw you. And this hole sucks. I just want to get a par and get out of here. Wind downwind with that pin too? This is literally flat out impossible. <laughs> Ew. No. Is that enough? I feel like yes. Might be even too much still, but we're going to try it. That's not good. Oh my god. That's a spectacularly bad golf shot. Into the pine straw we go. And I said I'd, I'd take a par and run here, and I meant it. I meant it for real. It's gotta be short, right? Oh, you, get out of here with that shit. Get out of here with that shit. Come on. He's gonna okay, bird this now, isn't he? he oh my god, what a shot. That's a disgusting green. shot from Kentley. Right, I gotta hit a flopperoony here, to be honest. It's gonna land on the down slope, so. That's not distracting at all, that that's just spinning around in my face. That's what she said! That's a good shot, though. Okay, Kentley, come on. Let's see if we're gonna make this birdie. And really add insult to injury here. Yep. This is gonna be bad, guys. God, I'm heartbroken. Good par from us, but lost another one to Cantley. This is gonna be a long day, guys. Fino now out of nowhere is 21 under. All right, we got lots of time left though. All right, we gotta just stay positive. We gotta try, try, try our best to stay positive, because it's gonna be easy to get down on ourselves when the AI has a couple of good holes. But you never know what can happen. You just never know. The AI could have a couple of bad holes, and we could have a couple of good holes, and it's turned on its head. You know, two shots swing on any particular hole, and or something special can happen. Anything can happen. A final round surge. Good shot. Good shot, a little bit of a pull on the swing plane towards the end, but that's going to be just fine. Position A. The the Position A, middle of the fairway. 186 yards left. That's ideal. This hole's quite difficult, From especially the with the, the way the green Check is. As I always say, Find I find this to be one of the, the more difficult greens on the course. Hit the green. A series of undulations and bumps really make it tough to get it close. That's not going to get up there. Oh, it does actually. It stays up. Wow. Okay. I thought that was going to come all the way back. Still not an easy putt, but wouldn't surprise me if they, I decided, uh, fuck it, we'll make that one. <laughs> you know, it just wouldn't surprise me. Uh, let's have a look here. So, I can't really be short. All right, we got to try this, I guess. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Talk dirty to me. Talk dirty to me. Go. Oh, it's a beauty. It's a beauty. Great shot on this hole. 12 foot for a birdie. Any bit shorter than that, though, and we would have been in trouble. That's why I hate this hole. Like, any bit shorter than that, I probably would have came off the green. We'll take it. Let's see if Cantley is going to take his opportunity here with a 43 foot birdie putt. You might like this one. You might really like it. 
Frank, that's just a really good putt right there. Good putt. Yeah, really Thank God. I thought when he, when he said he might really like this, I thought it was going in. I was like, oh, God. <laughs> but luckily for us, it doesn't. It's 1.8 degrees above. I don't even need to look at that. Let's just look at the break. Okay. It's uphill slightly. It's not crazy. I'm going to go 17 foot with about this much of break. It's breaking right to left the whole way. No. Need a little more. Yeah, that, I was thinking if anything, it did need a little more, but it's hard to judge. It's hard to judge with these greens. Augusta is just so difficult. All right. Good par there. Honestly, I would have taken a par on the tee box, but can't help but feel a little disappointed that we didn't gain one on him there. Okay. Cantley, Cantley, Cantley. Pops in for his par, and we move on to the par 3 6 which I always struggle with as well. For some reason, the front nine, I'm just not good at it, Augusta. The front nine is difficult, man. I find it to be a lot more difficult than the back nine. The front nine and the end of the back nine. It's like that little part at the, like the first six holes of the front uh, of the back nine. I'm like, yeah, this is where I come alive. That's where I always do my scoring. Other than that, I'm genuinely like not that good at Augusta. It's just that I, I play really well in that particular part of the course the whole time. All right, good shot, Captain. I just off the green. All right, we need to just. This is super, super tough because it's like. It's just that one patch that we can really make work. I think I need to hit a finesse seven iron. I think a finesse seven iron works. With a little bit of height, take a little bit off it, and we'll go with that. Thoughts? I hope this isn't long. Oh, it's left. Fuck's sake, it's not long. It's definitely not long. That's sure. That's gonna be all the way. Ah! I was aiming for the right as well, and I, I stopped aiming. Oh, this is just the Solid worst putt in the world as well. I hate it. I let, I never, ever, ever can hit this putt hard enough, and I mean that. Oh. I'm not even trolling. I'm going to 100 feet immediately. I just don't know what to do here, to be honest, but I'm just going to go for 100 foot. So it would be... Like, I'm genuinely serious. I think it might be more. I'm going 104. Still not even nearly enough. That's crazy! You need to go to like one, 115 or something. That is so insane to me. Cantley is not going to make at least, but we still have an 8-footer for par, man. We have an 8-footer for par here. I do not want a 3-putt at this moment in time. That would be awful. It would be awful for the cause. It's breaking to the right, really. Okay. Not a lot, but it definitely is breaking to the right. I'll play just outside left. Yes, that's huge. That is huge, honestly. Come on. No bo we can't afford a single bogey today. I'm not even joking. We cannot afford a single bogey today. If we bogey a single hole, we're done. We're three shots back already. Cantley's not going to make bogeys. And if we make bogeys, we're done. It's as simple as that. Any single bogey is going to is going to take us out of contention completely. We're already on the precipice of being out of contention. If Cantley decides to go ham or something... But we're, we're still in it right now. We're three shots behind the leaders. We need to come up with something. It's that stretch. 11, or sorry, no. 13, 14, 15. Where you can really make it happen. That's why I still have confidence that we can do this. That stretch of holes really makes you believe that you can uh, you can do anything. Like, you can go five under through that section. Like, genuinely. You can go four or five under through that section. Or even three, four under genuinely can be enough to, to take you from three shots back to level. You know? So, it's... Absolutely. Obviously, it's scorable for the other people too, but you got to take advantage of it. Right. I, I found that now, either three wood or maybe even a little stinger driver here could work. Yeah, I'll try. I'll try the stinger driver. Why'd that go so far right though? Like that makes no fucking sense to me there. Why that just shot right like that? Awful. Awful fucking shot, man. I don't know why I hit the stinger there. Like, it is. Oh, that is so frustrating, honestly, because I think the pin's over the right, too, is it? Oh, maybe not. He's in and we left. Oh, it is. Yeah, we're in trouble. All right, that's going to be difficult, though. Watch him make it. Oh. All right, I have to play a big giga fade here, or else I'm going to clip a tree. I don't think that's enough, but this is... Yeah, I need this. All right, let's try it. Here we go. That's so bad. They clipped it. It fucking clipped it! 
God, you're an, you're an absolute dickhead for that, honestly. I should have just taken the three wood. I'm such an- I'm so upset with myself about that one. I really am. God. Fucking infuriating, that is. Great shot. Great shot. Should be good enough for a par, I hope. Okay. I'm frustrated right now. It's like we need to be giving ourselves birdie chances and I'm scrambling for par on every hole at the moment. If I don't turn it around soon, Patrick's going to put a dagger in me. Real soon. And this could be it. There it is. Yep. There it is. Four shots back now. I'm not even playing bad either, it's just like... Well, I'm not playing great, but the AI is just disgusting, this tournament, man. 23 under Cantley is like... Through his last 25 holes, I'm pretty sure he's like... Fucking 13 under or something. Oh. This is frustrating. Alright, well done, Cantley. Why the rhythm is Oh, come on! How's that going that far fucking left? Someone tell me! Fast 0.6%! We're fucking dead and buried. We're only seven holes in, and I'm one under! He's gonna bury this as well. It's gonna be three in a row. No. I mean, not bad actually. It's gonna go all the way through the green. Hack has just zero spin whatsoever. Not bad, I guess. But I mean, we need bur we need to birdie pretty much every hole from here until the end if we want to win this thing. I'm not even exaggerating. We need to fucking be ten under for the last ten holes or something. Like, look at this. This is gonna be happening every single time. And Captain is just yeah. AI on a hundred. Like, I like that the the rest of the field is involved, but the AI playing partner is just dumb on this difficulty, and I mean it, like, it's dumb. Alright, we gotta hit a flop here, I think. It's gone that far?! I underswung it! And it carried past the pin! Good birdie. Two under, 20 under, but I'm somehow four back, which is criminal, and I mean criminal that I'm four back. 20 under, with 10 holes to go, and I'm four back. Bloody hell. Yeah, Captain is four under through eight, I think it was 10 under, so he's 14 under for the last 26 holes. <laughs> like, what can you do against that? Aragosta! The only way we're gonna win is if Cantley has a heart attack on the course. That's literally the only way I have a chance. If Cantley has a heart attack or a plane crashes into him or something, I don't know. Like, that's the only way we have a, a slim chance. There's no way we're beating him head to head here. He's just... He's ridiculously good. Yes, sir. Great drive. Great drive. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, this is going to come back close to the pin. Watch. Watch. This is going to be fucking one foot from the hole. <laughs> I mean, like, what the fuck do they expect you to do? This one's looking good. Yay. I've hit a good one too. It's not like we're still going to be four back or anything. I can make as many birdies as I want, but it's not going to matter, unfortunately. It's actually not makeable. This is not very uh, easy either, I mean to say. Good putt, though. Good putt. Back to back birdies to close out the front nine. That's a solid front nine. That's a solid front nine right there. But Catlin's going to have a five under front nine. And when you're already two back going into the day, he's just like, wow. He doesn't miss either. He does not miss. Three birdies in a row, 25 under. I think Catlin's putting the dagger in us early here, guys. Uh oh. 
Oh, this is well left. Oh. Can't they clip the trees? He's 200 and watch him still make par. And guarantee gonna I guarantee he doesn't make a bogey this whole round. In the second he part. might still make birdie, actually. <laughs> he might still make birdie, actually. Watch, like, there's no way he's making a bogey on any hole on this on this round. <laughs> Did not turn in for me at all. Oh, God. Should be okay still. No, it's not okay at all. In fact, it's awful. Wow. Oh. I've had enough. I'm heartbroken. Right to left. Let's clip the tree again there. Okay. I mean, I'll, I'll happily, I'll happily be wrong if he wants to make a bogey. I'll very happily be wrong. Now, I need to play a punch here. That's the crazy part. Second. I haven't had to play many punches in my day, so I don't really even know how they work too well. But we're gonna try a five iron punch. Is that crazy? Yeah, fuck it, Yolo. That is way too much. Thank God for your shoe, lady. Thank God for your shoe. Okay, I, I did not realize the punches are that quick. That also carried way further than it said it was going to, I swear. All right, Patrick. To 11 foot for a par. I've got to get up and down still, though. Imagine Patrick makes a bogey and I make a bogey, too. I will be so furious with myself at the one hole Patrick bogeys I also bogey. Oh, my God. Man, I went I went long on the last flop, so I really didn't want to fucking overswing it here, and I underswung by three percent and came up seven foot short. God damn it, that's infuriating. We're both. He's gonna make it, and I'm gonna. <laughs> Negative Nancy here. Come on, we gotta be better than this. <gasps> Believe he made par. Oh wait, yes I can. Yep. Well done, man. Well done, you absolute fucking waste of space. What a sick joke this round has been, man. The final round at Augusta, Cantley's 25 under. Lovely stuff, well done. Yeah, I don't think I can play on 100 AI. Like, this is just isn't fun. Like, I like the leaderboard around me. Like, all the players being close to me. I love that. But I just don't, I don't, like, I don't enjoy playing with the AI playing partner like this. It's just dumb. If they're just going to hit. Every time they, they get out of position, every single time they get out of position, they find a way to make a par. And if they're not out of position, they make a birdie. It's, it's kind of simple. It's just like that. You know? Like, I don't know what else you can say, really. That's, that's the way it is. And it's just not fun like that for me, at least. I like bouncing off the AI playing partner and having fun going head to head with them. But like if it's like this, it's just not really fun. That's me personally though. That's way short. I'd probably make it still. Oh no, it's not way short actually. It's really good. Looked like it was gonna be way short. Yep. Well done, man. I've lost my head now. Thanks for that wonderful fucking display. Thank you. Yeah, good spinner, but Patrick Cantley is probably going to go five clear of us here. Or is it six clear of us? Yeah, I think it's six. All right, he's missed one at least. Yeah, even if I have like the best last seven holds of all time now. I don't think we have much of a chance. Hey, what a depressing final round this is. Like, it's just, it's not even being competitive. That's why it's depressing, you know? Like, I haven't done myself any favors, but at the same time, even if I was playing well, I don't think there's any chance. I would have to be seven under right now through 11 holes. And at Augusta, on Sim, that's just not really reasonable. You know, I'd have to be that to be tight. I'd have to be eight under through 11 to be leading. It's just... Never gonna happen, really. Near the top of those towering pines that we need Pat Cantley to go in the water like seven holes in a row. Well, there's once. Oh, of course it's not. <laughs> He'll make a par still. <laughs> I thought that was gonna be in the water. It looked like it was 100% gonna be in the water for a second. Uh, I think fucking normal pitching wedge could be good here. Is that crazy? Yeah, it is. It is crazy. The wind is going more to the right now than anything. 
No, but now it's downwind. See, that's why it's confusing. Ah, I don't know what to do. Nope, now it's just off the right. Make your mind up! I just gotta hit it. I can't wait here all day. Good shot, I guess. Yeah, considering the circumstances, not bad. Not a bad one. Shut up, John, please. Not even John, but still. <laughs> I'm just used to abusing John for it. All right, great shot, Cantley. I already know you're making that putt, so... It just takes the fun out of it when you know what's going to happen every time. That's all I'll say about the AI. When you know they're going to make the, the par putt. When you know they're going to make the birdie putt. Every single, it just takes the fun completely out of it, you know? Like, if there's a... The drama is the whole... The suspense, the drama is the fun of it. When you know what's going to happen every single time and it's really predictable, that's when it's just boring. Go on. Really? That's a short, you dickhead. God damn it. Oh, he's actually missed one. He's actually missed one. We've gained one on him. Can't believe it, honestly. I can't believe it. I think it's got to the point where the AI is like, actually, we're far enough ahead now that we don't need to play the best golf ever. <laughs> we don't need to play the best golf ever anymore. All right, I'm going eagle, birdie, eagle on the next three, okay? Eagle, birdie, eagle on the next three, and we're going to be uh, a couple shots back then. <laughs> Probably still will be. All right, we need an eagle here, though. Plain and simple, if we want any hope of winning this, we need an eagle here. Some noise, one hole in a thousand stories, heroic ones, sad ones. Today, maybe a new one. Maybe a new one indeed. That just did not come back around the way I wanted it to, but that's going to be perfect. Ideal. Right. Uh, 215 okay. yards, that's fine. It didn't draw like I wanted to, but that's that's okay. We've got a good chance for an eagle. Make three long putts. I haven't made any putts. That's. I think my biggest issue today has been my putting. I haven't made shit, really. And Cantley's been... When, when the AI's making everything and you're not making anything, it's just demoralizing as hell. All right, Cantley has a chance to go for it in two as well, I think, from this Just angle. 235, do, maybe he'll go for it, maybe he won't. I don't know. I'll be surprised if he doesn't now from 235 because he has a clear he has a clear look at it here. I'd love if he went for it and put it in the water, though. That would be awesome. That would be awesome. Oh, for fuck's sake. Like, the shit, they got so lucky, the AI. I swear. All right. It's not bad at all. It wasn't a good shot, but it's not bad at all. Like, that pin position is dangerous, but I kind of like the look of the six iron in there. That's so good. Please be good. Please be good. Sit. Sit. Really? The fuck? I know it was downhill, but it was uphill. As uh, downhill, but it was up downwind rather, but it was uphill as well. Like I can't believe that went 43 foot past. All right, it's about time we made a long putt, isn't it? All right, he's still making birdie though. Watch, still making the still making the birdie. So we're gonna need the eagle putt to to gain one on him here, no doubt. And we need to be gaining more than one anyway. So it's like, yeah, this is difficult, but got to make it work. I'm going to go with something like this. I know that looks crazy, but I'm going to go with something like that. Not enough break. Good effort. Look at the pace on this thing. Slow down! Oh my god. I brought, I brought 10 foot off that and still it went 10 foot by. So I needed to take 20 off it? Like, that's crazy. Yeah, we're not even a gimme birdie yet. Could be one of those holes where we still end up doing worse than Cambly <laughs> Oh, he misses, he misses, okay. He misses, but we're not a gimme. Like, I, even when Cantley has had the holes where it's like, oh, maybe maybe it's not the craziest thing in the world, we, we still don't take advantage, which is the problem. So this is above, and it doesn't really turn back. Like, it's above right at my feet. So I don't think it's going to affect it too much, but it's uphill as well. I'm going to go with something like this. Right lip. Yes! Oh, yes! Birdie to within three with five to play. It's still highly unlikely, but we've got to, we've got to, we've got to somehow keep the faith here, you know? Got to somehow keep the faith. All right, we need a, we need Birdie Eagle here. Birdie Eagle on the next two. We need a streak. We need a streak like you wouldn't believe here to finish off. 
It's not completely out of the realms of possibility, you know? Come on, we can do this. Come on. Let's go. Let's play a high draw. Yes, perfect. Absolutely perfect. Left side, gorgeous shot, and a wedge in. So let's wedge it close. Make a birdie here. A birdie here would be massive. This hole isn't easy. This hole isn't easy. Five holes left. Three shots back. Cantley takes three wood. Plays it perfectly down the right side. A little bit of a longer shot for Cantley, but not bad. 200. Yeah, 190. Let's see if Cantley can put it close from 190. Let's go to Noda. Hall definitely sitting in the go zone. If you can hit your number, ball could get really close. Yeah, is he going to get over the hill here? Yeah, it's going to watch it bounce towards the hill and be perfect. Okay. I mean, 39 foot. I just hope he doesn't make that. That would ruin the, the day. <laughs> it would simply Noda. ruin the day the if he makes that. Right, I'm going to go with a little knockdown shot here. That long? How does that carry? I thought it said it was one. It said it was 151 to the back. Did I read that wrong? It said it was 151 to the back of the green. But mine carried 145, and it's way off the back. I knew it. I fucking knew it, dude. Yeah. Any like, I fucking knew that was happening as well. I said, I said, I hope he doesn't make that because I knew he was making it. It's just a joke. He's trying to work back into it. Four back with four to go. Yeah, four back with four to go. It's fucking over. Shut up. Oh, that is the way to play it. Just Great chipping. Great chipping. Like, see, uh, the hype of that would have been immense if Cantley just didn't hold a 40-footer before me, you know? <laughs> Like, the hype for that chip-in would have been mega. But of course, Cantley had to ruin my little moment there. Dickhead. He's such a dickhead. Need an eagle here, plain and simple. Yes! Get down there now! Go on! Go! Go! Alright. 178 yards left. I need to eagle this. We're three shots back with three to play. Four to play, rather. Cantley's taking iron off the tee box. Because of course he is. He hits a 200 yards and leaves himself 338. I dare you to hit this dead into the water. Come on. No, that's perfect. Damn it, I was hoping he'd go into the water. I was hoping he'd go into the water. <laughs> Sometimes the AI just does that. Alright, I, I need a bloody eagle. 162. Oh, this could be perfect, man. Come on. Nine iron finesse. Win behind me. I'm gonna play it like 160 shot. Sonoma. Is that really that long? So I had to play it more like a one fucking 45 shot. Like I had a pitching wedge there. That's crazy to me. Shot selection so critical from here. Choose wrong and you will find the water. God, it's just not my day, man. <laughs> Nearly. It's going to be three straight birdies, but I said I needed eagle birdie eagle. And that's ringing true because Cantley's going to birdie this one as well. Ah, oh, man. Even if it gained two through this section, it would have made it interesting, but no, 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 no. Can't I had other ideas. He makes back-to-back -back birdies and pretty much puts the dagger in our heart. Three back with three to play. We need a hole in one. We need a hole in one birdie birdie. <laughs> All right, let's try it. Right, I'm going to try something. Try something. Let's make it work. Come on, baby. Good chance at one. Sit. Sit. I went that far. Come back down. Come back down a little more. Keep coming. Oh, it stopped there. I thought that might come back to the pin, but good shot. Really good shot. It just thought it was a little bit too much. Maybe the 174 finesse would have been perfect, actually. 
I thought the 174 was going to be short, but maybe not. Yeah, Cantley's played a beauty. Oh, that's trouble. No, he hasn't. Go in the water. Go in the water. Oh, that is an uncharacteristic mistake in what has been a round full of. You should not be able to drop it there, by the way. This is the one time I have a problem with the drop system. <laughs> Dude, I, I I'd love if he flubbed it into the bunker. Now that'll be awesome. That is so lucky, dude. Don't make this. Please don't make this. I'm on my knees. Don't make this. Oh my god. He made a double. Am I even second? I'm third. I need to make this putt anyway. Name just outside his marker. It's like it's breaking a lot where right where my ball is, but it stops breaking that much halfway down. Oh my god. We're one back. No, we're level. Two back with two to play. Oh my god, are we tied for the lead right now? Three shot swing? It's a three-way tie! Holy shit! What am I witnessing? I never in my wildest dreams could have imagined Cantley made a double bogey. Never in my wildest dreams. This is why you never give up. This is... Why is that going so far left? Make that make sense to me! Like, that's perfect! It's a zip... It's less than one on either side. Alright, I'm just hoping the pin isn't left. If it's right hand side, and I think Sunday's pin is back right, right? I cannot believe Cantley just double bogey that man. Like I flat out can't believe it. And he's got 192 in here. 192 into the wind. I have a feeling Cantley's gonna hit a good one though. He's never gonna he's never gonna let that happen where he's gonna double bogey it and just not bounce back. He's gonna bounce back, isn't he? Short, be short. Get off the green. Get off the green! Go on, keep going! Cantley's falling apart. Cantley's falling apart. We need to birdie. If we can birdie five in a row here, this could be the best birdie you'll ever see in your life here if we can get this close. Alright, everybody needs to calm down. I know we're close to a birdie yet, alright? I need to play draw. That's the problem. Please be good. I'm on my knees. Sit, 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 sit! Oh, it's okay. It's okay. Dude, imagine it was the first ever playoff at the Masters. I don't think we've ever had a playoff at the Masters. He's going to make that. He's going to make that, though. 13 foot. We need to We need to play this putt like he's going to make that. Because I'm so confident that he will. Okay, so it's it's uphill the whole way. I thought towards the end of this, it was going to be downhill. It's 2.6 above? I think it's because the, the slope at my feet is going to be a lot. I don't think it's going to break that much. He's definitely going to break a little bit from right to left. Like, definitely... It's uphill slightly. I'm going to go with something like this. Oh! It needed just a touch more break. Oh my god, this has turned into an electrifying video all of a sudden. Like, I was cocksure it was done. I cannot believe what's happened here. If he misses this, we're tied with Badley. Miss it. Come on, please. I, I've never wished for anything in my life. He's le he's left it short, does he? Oh my god! Oh my god! Everybody stay calm. Everybody stay calm. We need to make this still. God. Oh my god. Okay. One hole left. We're tied for the lead. I hope. Cantley's gone double bogey bogey. You can hardly believe it. You can hardly believe it. Who would have thunk it? Who would have thought it, man? He was he was just on fire. Even after the bogey on 12, like you were just kind of it seemed like it was a formality almost. But badly, still is 24 under with two to play. I need to birdie this realistically. I need to birdie this to be sure, or else I know I'm gonna see. If I par this, I know for a fact I'm gonna see badly 25 up there. I need to play for a birdie. 100% I need to play for a birdie. All right, I'm gonna take this back just a touch because I'm scared of that bunker. 
Oh, please, please don't go in that bunker. Stop. Stop! Stop! Dude, the overswing killed me. I cannot believe it. I cannot believe it. The overswing fucking killed me. Oh, it would have been so perfect if it wasn't for the overswing. God damn it! Alright, we just need to hope Cantley doesn't birdie as well. How about a three-way playoff for the fucking Masters? That would be incredible. That's not going to be a birdie. Okay. That's not going to be a birdie. It's, it's me versus Badley. It's me versus Badley. Cantley's out of it. He has completely imploded. It's a Patrick Cantley implosion at the Masters. Oh my god, he's laying up! <laughs> Alright, I... The fuck?! My god, he's killed him! I ping-ponged all five people! It's one of the weirdest implosions I've ever seen at Augusta. Okay, with that pin, this actually might be okay. I'm not even trolling. This might be a good thing. No, I don't want to say that, but... 178 Club. Is that is that going to get there? No! Dude, I knew it was going to go left, but I just didn't know it would go that far left. Dude, if we lose this to Aaron Badley after all this, I swear to God. Dude, if we lose it to Aaron Badley, I am going to just implode. Oh my goodness, we need to flop this. That's the crazy part. I don't think I can play a spinner here. I can, maybe I can, actually. No, oh, it's landing on a down slope is the only thing I'm worried about. I'm going to flop it. I'm committing to the flop. Don't underswing the flop, though. That's all I'll say. I underswing the flop. But I'll tell you what, that's perfect. Come on. Please give me a playoff at least. I'll take a playoff right now. I'll take a playoff right now. I, I have a feeling that the AI, to avoid playoffs with non... With players that aren't in the game, just change their scores so that they end up winning. Or losing. I don't know. And I'm hoping it's losing here. I'm just taking my time with this one. I, be, I need to be careful. This is for 24 under. Cantley's had one of the worst implosions of all time. But will it matter in the end? Our four birdies in a row there. Could have sent us into something special here. But... Dude, I know I'm just... It's happened so many times where I've lost by one shot. It's happened so many times where i lost by one shot on this very hole. Oh my god, it's a playoff! I won! Oh my god! I won! I won! It hadn't adjusted badly scored for the last. He bogeys the last. And we win the Masters. Can you believe it? We've gone back to back in Augusta. You cannot believe this, son. You can't believe this. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Get out of that. Out of that. Come on, baby. That's what we're cooking here in Augusta. That's how we do it. Get in there, baby. Unbelievable. Get in. Woo! <laughs> Cantley finishes double bogey, bogey, bogey. And we finish four under for the last six to clip it away from him and clip it away from Aaron Badley. You can hardly believe it, son. But we've done it. We've gone back to back at Augusta after all our woes. It looked hopeless. It looked hopeless 11 holes in. 11 holes in, I was six shots off the lead at one point. I think Maybe I was five back with seven to play or something. And we somehow did it. Oh, I've qualified for the RBC Heritage, guys. That's great. Thanks. Get in! Is that the perfect way to finish a career right there? With the green jacket at Augusta, let me know. Should we start a new career now? Thank you, guys, for all the many memories on this one. It's been absolutely incredible. If this is to be my final tournament, we've signed off with an absolute bang like you wouldn't believe. Thanks for watching. Really appreciate it. We will be back with more career mode, whether it's with a new character, a female character maybe. Uh, we could do a female career and a male career, like a new male career and a new female career. Who knows? I'm kind of open to the idea. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. It's been an absolute pleasure to serve you all here on this journey. And, uh... I can't wait for many more memories on this game, on other games, whatever it may be. What 
a way to win it. Thanks for watching. Peace out.